not because I have to do urgently today. Eh? No. So, anyway, from Peter, are you sure it's not getting late? Huh? At least you can wait till tomorrow, then we'll move together, you know. You see, my sister, it's not getting the best time. And you know, I have something very important to do. Eh? So, please just let me be on my way. I'll be fine. Right, let no him go now. After all, you, you don't understand this program now. Right. Oh. Take care of yourself. It is well with you, bro. You. Take care of myself now. Ah, no Take care. Bye. Take care. All right, good yeah. journey. I'm out. I'm out. Waiting now. Ah. What is the meaning of this now? So you want to follow him? Follow him now. Uh uh, are you jealous? Uh. No, I am not jealous. So if you want to follow him, follow him. <laughs> but anyway, have you forgotten that when we were in school, it was our fellowship president while I was a secretary? Ah, uh. Epileo, secretary. So that is what gives you the audacity to love him more than me, right? Uh uh, what nonsense are you talking about? Oh. Uh uh, as I said, then we relate like one family. Oh, uh. one family indeed. Oh. Follow him. Oh. Just follow him, secretary of the ministry. Uh -uh. But there's nothing between us now. Won't you wait for me? Oh, yeah, come, don't laugh. I told you that you really told me one needs to... Excuse me, please. I am not ready to listen to anything concerning your children. Your children or her children? You heard me right. Your children. Oh please, goodness. I have a lot of work to do in my house. Even my car has issues. Please, I have to fix them before anything. Please, excuse hey, me. But, but dear, please wait now. Not again. But do you know I tried this running temperature for two days now? And so, sort yourself out. Yeah. Excuse me, you heard me right. Sort yourself out. Mommy, I heard everything. Oh. So you heard everything between your dad and I? Yes, ma'am. Mommy, fine. why is it that every time daddy is always shouting on you? Why is he always shouting on you? Oh, you told me why. You know your dad is always busy at work. Every time you say he's busy at work. It's alright, okay? Um, everything is fine. You just need to put in some things in order, okay? Not to worry, okay? Okay, ma'am. Alright, is your younger sister ready? Yeah. Alright, so let's get ready and my bag is in. Let's go get my bag.
eating here alone and are you not going home? Let us go. I don't feel like going to my house. Follow me to my yard. I will tell my daddy to tell your mommy. See, my daddy will buy plenty things for you. He always buy something for my sister and I. Hadi Umi, your daddy is waiting for you. Come on, let's go. Auntie Ebon is riding with us. No, what if our mommy comes? My daddy will call her mom. You know what? I will call her mom. You go and meet her. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. How are you, my princess? Ebu, how are you? Ebu. Daddy, she is not happy. She doesn't want to go home. Oh, you can be funny, my princess. Okay, I will call her dad. I've called Ebu's mom. Oh, yeah. thank you very much. God bless you. Yeah. Come in, please. Alright. Yeah, here we go. How was it? Good afternoon, sir. How are you? I'm fine. And how is everything? I'm doing well. Thank you so much, sir. It's okay. You're welcome, madam. Yes, Don't mention, okay? Um, Ebu, yeah, for your, uh, for you and your sister, okay? So. Thank you, sir. Wow, we are very grateful, sir. Oh, madam, no. Please, sir. Are you God? Oh, Ebu! Why did you ask? Our teacher told us about God that He loves us. He always gives good gifts. He is also kind. That is what He always do. But my daddy is not like that. That is why I asked, maybe you are God. You see, I am not God. I am only a child of God. And I need to behave like one to show that I am a true child of God. Okay, is my daddy not a child of God? Ah. Ebu, please, allow that. To go and drop Wumi, eh? He will tell you more next time. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Sir. Yes, sir. Do you know what? I'm going to inform your daddy to allow you and your sister to come and spend weekend with us. Is that okay by you? Yes. Then we'll talk. Alright. All right. Have a blessed day. And you too. Okay, bye bye. Okay. bye, -bye. Jesus name. Thank you so much, ma. Thank you, ma. Madam, we have tried all our possible best in this school. Okay. But we noticed that she needs medical attention. Oh. But they've attended to her. Okay, ma. All right. Thank you, Mrs. Lizzie. I appreciate you so much. Thank you. It is all right, ma. I called Mr. Thompson. Okay, ma. But the moment he held me, mentioning Edun's name, he handed the call. Oh. And I'm trying to call him back, but his response was not encouraging at all. Is something wrong? Um, uh, no, 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 Mrs. Lizzie. Um, it's just that he's always busy at work. Yes. That's why. I can't believe a parent can behave in such manner 
when it comes to a case of a child, we are working because of them. I would like to take my leave now. All right, Sima. I really appreciate you. Thank you so much, Mrs. Lizzie. God bless you. Thank you, Ma. Ah. My dear, you will not break down. Your call now? Huh? What sort of man is this? Okay, let me send him a voice note. Hello, hello dear. Ebu is not feeling fine. She has been admitted, yes, at Etman Hospital, um, around Ariba Onwo area. Yes, when you are coming from, well, please kindly check on us. All right, bye for now. Just pray you respond to this. No, 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 me. no, 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 Afternoon. Yes, sir. Hey, well, how are you? Oh, so sorry. I, I was arguing with a uh, woman when she told me Ebon is not feeling fine. And she has been disturbing me to come and check on her. Ah, I was at work when I received a call from her school that she was at the hospital. So we've been discharged for some minutes now. If not that we've been waiting for a cab, you won't have met us here. Oh. Cab? Why cab? Call my friend to come and pick you up. Your friend, uh -uh, that you've always known. <laughs> He's very busy these days. He does not even have our time. Oh. You mean he has not come to check on you? Oh. He even calls. He couldn't even pick our calls. He didn't even give me fit to return our calls, nor even answer his call. <laughs> this is not good at all. Oh. I will really need to talk to him. He's my friend, and I believe he will change. It's okay, let me take you home. Oh. And um, I would like to drop by the supermarket to get something for Ebo. Oh, thank you for all this, sir. May God continue to bless you. Okay. I'm sorry, but the person is not even picking up his call. Ah, Tola, I want to get some fruit for my family. Hello. Okay. Ah. Are you not coming? For what? I mean, to get um, fruit for your children. The money on me is not meant for that purpose. You see, getting this fruit for children is very, very good for them. You know, instead of buying all these chemicals and I don't know, Tola, you need to you need you need to understand what I'm trying to say. Why are you like this? Ah, buying fruit for who? Or go go and buy your fruit and let us live here, guy. Buying fruit for who? Which 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 children are children are you talking about? Which I mean, children? Your children or my children? Tola, see your children are also my children. So oh, anything God. that is good for my children, I, I think it's good for ah, I don't like this, your Samo. Go and buy your fruit. Let's leave here. Yeah, and if you don't want to buy, let's go now. Which one is your children, my children? Who told you that I have children that is your children? Oh, God, go and buy your fruit and let's leave here. All right. Ah, madam, how are you? My children. Oh, our children. Okay, how much is this banana? Yes, sir, which has to be children. Uh, it's okay. 
Tola is really treading on a dangerous path. And if care is not taken, he will get hurt. Dad, Dad, I want to pray for you. Ah, you want to pray for me, my princess? Yeah, come. That's my girl. Okay. And Jesus name. Amen. You know that. Amen. You know sick. Amen. You know I'm a student in Jesus. Amen. Pray for my daddy. My daddy will not die in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Ah, ah, David. Awesome. Anna. I'm fine. I'm good. Um, what are you doing here? <laughs> Does this place look like a buffer? <laughs> Tola, you can yes, never change. Yes, sir. Ah. Okay, I, I want to get something for my family. Ah, that was good. I came to get something for myself too, as I can see. Why is it always you? You, you, yourself, and you, Tola? What about your wife and your children? You have to show them love. Even if you can't come with them here, yeah, show them love. Get something for them, Tola. David, did God report me to you? But what's your problem? Why the issue of my family? My when are you going to leave my family alone for crying out loud? <sighs> okay, Tola, you just need to understand me. Um, <laughs> I really want to see you. See me for what? Come family issue again? Please, I'm not. I'm not ready no, for that. No, Tola, we need to talk. Talk for what? It is five minutes. We need to really talk. Okay. All right. I was told you have been busy at work recently. I beg you, my friend, make time for your family. You see, if everybody leaves, your family will be all you have. Ebon has been in the hospital for days now. You refuse to pick their cause. You don't even check, on, check back on them. I know that woman reported me to you. And I'm going to seriously deal with her. I promise her that. My friend is not like that. You just have to understand what I'm telling you. I am your friend. I must tell you the truth. You see, our children look up to us as an example. If you fail to show them love and the right path, they will look up to someone else who cares to pay attention to them. My friend, I think it is high time, you know, we go our different way. Because I don't understand this issue of friendship that you keep hammering on my family. My, what is it with my family? Can you please leave my family alone? Oh, what's the problem? You want one piece of remain, Johnny? What, what's the problem? See, you have to understand. You understand are what? You are my friend. I need to talk to you. Please. please. As for I am not your friend. I'm no longer your friend. Go your way. Let me go my way. Tola. Excuse me here, John. Tola. Tola, please come back here. Let's talk. Mommy, it's time to eat, but we have to pray before we eat. Yeah. Where is Daddy? Hmm. I understand we used to pray and eat together as a family, but right now, that is not out. Daddy did not tell me when he's going now. I understand. Eh, Mommy, I apologize on his behalf. It's just that the trip is an urgent trip. When is this coming back? See, come and eat. When we are done, eh, I will explain to you. Miriam. Mommy, let's thank God for the food. You know, it is God that provided the food for us. Today I say thank you, Jesus. So, I want to tell you something. You know, earlier, I told you that your dad is not around. Mm -hmm. Your dad is in the hospital. And I had to say that so that you will not feel bad. And in fact, it was your dad that asked me to come and cook for you. So, Why do you like to eat the food? Mommy, don't be annoyed. I know I lied, and I first brought you for this room. Eh? Like I said earlier, I don't want you to feel bad. That was why I said it should have good. In fact, if the daddy said I should tell you that. How are we going to see you? Hmm. The doctor will not allow that, but I want to stay with him. Oh, stay with me. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, who is that? Sorry, excuse me. Victoria, sister, 
Who is staying with you? So your auntie is here. She's going to stay with you. Of course. I'm oh, yet for you, okay? So now, yeah. Victoria, I'm going out now. So anytime she's going to bed, you pray with her. Do you understand? So I need to. Do you want to fast? I want to fast so that I can pray for my daddy. <sighs> Mommy, do you know you can eat and still pray for your daddy? And God will answer your prayers. I want to pray to Jesus Christ to heal my daddy and bring him back home to me. Mommy, Ma? God is going to bring your daddy back, okay? Yeah. Just believe, okay? But still, you have to eat your food. So you can have enough strength to pray for him. Okay? Yes. Don't worry. God will heal your daddy, okay? In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Amen. Let us pray again that God should heal Mr. David and he should get him out of your spirit too. Prayer. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, Lord, heal Mr. David and so Lord, get him out of your spirit too. You read for me one. Ebu, what is going on here? Mr. David is in the hospital. Are you serious? Yes, ma'am. <sighs> okay, let's let's pray together. Let's kneel down and continue praying. That God should heal him. Oh yeah, let's continue. Say, oh God, my father. Lift up your healing hands upon Mr. David. In the mighty name of Jesus, Lord Jesus, oh Lord. Lift up your healing hands upon Mr. David. In the name of Jesus, lift up your healing hands upon Mr. David. I'm not 
that behave this way. You, you are a pastor. I, I, I keep telling you. You are a pastor. Don't just call him You want to implicate me? You, 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 what? In fact, I, I don't have issues. to me I have been to several places where you normally go nowhere to be found oh, I called my husband to help me out no response from him at all no positive result from him too oh, oh. and if I inform my mother that can affect her health a baby may rise. What else do I need to do? You me why? You me why? Where are you? Ah. Oh my God! You me why? Mommy, can we pray for your sister? Oh yes. Let us pray for her. Lord God, protect my sister Irene. Amen. Be with her. Amen. Don't let her die. Amen. And bring her back for my mommy and I. Amen. We want to see. Amen. Thank you, my daughter. Thank you. My daughter, you don't tell me why. in the name of God. Her daughter is missing. Yet you did nothing. Join me to find her daughter. Her daughter is missing. Yes, her daughter. daughter. Yes. 
I'll be your daughter. Your daughter is missing. And I say, sort yourself out. Is that too much for me to say? I don't understand. Ha. You're still on this matter of your daughter. <laughs> oh my God. Dear. Oh, it's not. I don't have time for this. Can't keep quiet any longer. Hey, you this you. heartless man. Ah. <laughs> Not be missing. Just calm down. Eh? Calm down. First of all, you have to come here first. Let's know how to put things in order. Let's strategize. Eh? I have searched everywhere. All our friends' place. Mommy, see. Just give me a few minutes. Let me go and report to the police first, please. Oh, oh, oh I had you. Just come first. Ah. Your child will not be missing, no problem. Come on. Is that taking? Okay, I'll be expecting you. Eh? <sighs> Mommy, why did you call for me? Ah, I want to be on my way. Die, yo! Calm down! Mommy. I can't stay for long. I, I'm looking for my child. Oh, mama, what now, mommy? Ah, ah. Where is this child? Mommy. Um. Ire! Ire! Oh my God! Ah. <laughs> Ire! Ire told me why. Do you want to kill me? Ah. Mommy, how come? Okay, don't worry. Uh, all right, and later I will call you back. All right, and don't worry, let me call you back, please. Okay. Hello? Ah. What are you doing here? Good evening, sir. Dickness granddaughter? Yes, sir. Ah. By this time, what are you doing here? But I'm not sure that grandma is coming here. Today. The time has gone already. Anyway, let me call her. Maybe. So I want to drink water. You want to drink water? Don't yes, call. Follow me, don't worry. But I will call her and confirm if she's coming. Mommy, thank God. You read to me what? Don't try that nonsense again. Why did you run away? I'm sorry, Ma. I was so afraid. I noticed my dad's face has changed. Ah. That's why I ran. I've also warned her not to try that stupid heart again. Eh. Huh? Ire. Ma? Will you be following your mom home? No, no, no. I'm not following my mom home. I'm going to stay here with you. Ire told me what? Ma? What about your sister? She would definitely miss you, you know. <sighs> Mommy, if that should be the case, let her be here. Oh, just, just leave her here. To your husband come back. All right, mommy. Today, 
you know, to inform you about the good news that finally we've seen our daughter, you know. And you just ended the call just like that. And since you've returned from work now, you didn't even, you know, show concern, didn't meet fit to even ask how we were able to see her, you know. Oh, uh, well, it was because I don't have a daughter that got missing. Your own daughter got missing. Excuse me? Is her daughter. I'm not your daughter. <laughs> hey, see, woman, woman, is all these gimmicks you are playing? You think I don't understand? I understand you. Who? Ada bank bogidi. O she kwe yele kubo. E yele bo. Titiri lo ntiri. Listen, let me tell you. That daughter of yours must not come to this house. That bastard must not come to this house. Otherwise, I will beat hell out of her. And if her sister form here, if her sister cross my path here, I will deal with her mercilessly. My own child is not a bastard. Ah, they play. Ah, they play. The parents must not speak like this. See, woman. You will soon be exposed. Exposed? Yes. I beg your Read pardon. my lips. You will soon be exposed. How? Nonsense. How? My wife. Exposed? Yes. Exposed? How? Ah. Eh. On si a yeli a go. On ino la to wash la yef Wait, wait. Come back here. Come and explain to me what you mean by exposed. Of me when I was not around. Nobody. <sighs> you see your father. He didn't call me. He didn't come to check on you. Is that a father? I don't like him. I just pray that he shouldn't come home. Ha! Stop saying that. Ire. I've always warned you, eh? Don't think of evil for anybody. Eh? It's only your dad. He's too wicked. I don't want to stay with him. My sister should come and stay here with hey. us. Jesus. Instead, let's pray for him. He can change. Eh? There's nobody that God cannot touch. Keep praying for him. Let's pray for him. He will change. Is that okay? Yes, ma'am. Eh? Yes, ah. ma <sighs> ah. What is the meaning of this trench? Who tied me this way? I just crossed the road to go and buy cane and a car rushed at me. It's just for me to deal with those stupid and bastard children of mine. Ah! Hmm. Anyway, yeah. you see this life, eh? Whatever anybody do to you, you just let go. Did you hear me? Yes, So that you can have peace and joy. Okay. You just forgive, forgive and forget. When the Bible says it, just forgive, just let go. Okay. Hmm? Yes, ma'am. By you holding grudges in your in your mind, you want to pronounce negative things. And it can come to pass. Did you hear me? Yes, ma Please. Okay, eh? ma whatever anyone, whatever anybody do to you, just forgive, forget, and let go. Hmm? Including your daddy. Yes. Hmm? Yes, ma'am. It may sound so hard. Hmm? You may not find it very easy. But just let go from your heart. Is that okay? Yes, ma'am. Hmm? Yes, ma'am. Dayo, what happened? Tola and we rushed to the hospital. Jesus. He had an accident. <laughs> so, I have just brought Ebu to stay with you. So I can go and stay with him. He's my husband. Wait, just calm down. Hope the accident is not that much. I don't know, yes, mommy. Just let me be on my way quickly. Okay, okay. Just just calm down. Eh? All will be well. Amen. Eh? Amen. Just calm down, please. Everything will be fine.
And that is what I say. Eh? That you should not say anything evil. You should be praying for him. Eh? I'm ah. sorry, Jama. Let, just ask for God forgiveness, oh. Just ask God to forgive you. Ah, is anybody there? Is anybody there? Anybody? Eh? Old man, please, untie me now. What is the need of this? Ah, just for me to discipline my own children. And you tie me this way. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah? If you don't untie me, if I stand up here and untie myself, I will deal with, I will beat a lot of you. What was the meaning of this? Do you know where I am? You are tying me. Because I'm... Okay, 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 please, untie it, untie it. I cannot untie you. Uh, because you are my friend. Your friend? Are you tying me this way? In fact, it is your children that sent me an errand to do this. Uh, uh, my children? My children sent you to do this to me, me, their father. Those, I said it. Those bastard children. If I stand up from here, I'll beat a lot of them. What nonsense? What audacity? What rubbish? New compass. Oh! Ebolo, that you? Ebolo, that you? Ebolo, that you? Yes. You are welcome. Ebolo, that you? I called you because of this wicked friend of mine, a hard elching person. Well, I'm satisfied with his behavior, but I have to fulfill the desire of his child so that I should take off his life. But if I did not take up this opportunity, he might receive the grace of forgiveness and also escape from the fullness punishment of this. What are you saying now? How could my child, my own children, ask you to do this to me? Uh, that is barbaric. Uh, it's not possible. It's not done anywhere. Oh, my friend. See, sincerely, you have made them suffer a lot. It is the fear that your children have that make them think of this. And I have to make, take up this opportunity. Um, Ebola, did you punish him? Oh. Don't beat oh. him. Beat him to the point that his life will end in the hell. Don't waste your time begging because I will not listen. Like that, I borrow that you will also listen. Because you do not listen to your children whenever they are requesting for apology. Oh. that God should place his healing hand on him. Prayer. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, place your healing hands on our daddy in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, heal him in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, heal him in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, place your healing hand on him in the mighty name of Jesus. Rest your healing hand upon him in the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Amen. Let us pray that God should release him from the hospital and he should come home safe and sound. Prayer. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, release our daddy from the hospital. Oh Lord, protect him to, to come home safe and sound in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, protect him to come home safe and sound in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, protect him in the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Amen. Let us pray for mommy that wherever she is, that God should protect her and that nothing bad should happen to her. Prayer, Father, in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, protect her mommy in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, protect her mommy in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, wherever she is, protect her. Let her come home safe and sound in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, protect her in the mighty name of Jesus. Keep her safe. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray. Amen. Let us pray for Grandma that God should give her long life and prosperity to stay with us. Prayer. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, 
Lord, give Grandma long life and prosperity to stay with us in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, give her long life and prosperity. Don't let her get sick in the mighty name of Jesus. Don't let her be victim of hospital bed in the mighty name of Jesus. Whom you hate because of bitterness of hearts and because you wanted to punish their mother. Because of bitterness of heart and because you want to punish their mother. They are the one interceding for you. And that is why I came here to set you free because of their prayers. There's no problem. The man is okay. Doctor, he's not okay. He's perfectly okay. There's no problem. The blood and the BP is normal. All the vitals and it's normal. There is no problem. Doctor, but you're too nice. It's don't not worry. okay. Don't worry. It will soon. It will soon do so. You don't have any problem. You don't have any problem. The man is okay. Don't All right. Worry. Thank you, doctor. Stop! It is not wrong to correct your children, but that correction must be done in love. It is wrong for you to correct your children in anger. It is wrong for you to correct them in bitterness of heart. It is wrong for you to correct your children in hatred. Where are my children? My children. Oh, my children. Thank God. Thank you, Jesus. Where are my children? Oh, thank you. Finally. Oh, thank you, Lord. Oh, you scared me. Yes, where are my Help children? Me. Yes, I'm sorry. What are you asking for? I know I've wronged you and the children. Please forgive me for my misconduct. Please, where are my children? So you can hurt our children or your children? Tell me, Tola Thompson. Is this really you or someone else? Dear, I'm sorry. For long, I thought there was something hidden between you and Peter. The, our president during our NYZ days. Most especially when I saw you together. Ah. That was what made it. All oh, this, I'm sorry. Ah. What I saw today. Hmm. Guess what? I saw Peter today. Hmm. Yes, Peter. Peter. Yes, the same Peter now. He's now a pastor. Glory be to God. He came to minister in one of the branches, you know. Hmm. He even gave me a ride when I was coming home to this house. Yeah. And he blessed me with money. He ran to this house. Yes. And he blessed you with money. Yes, dear. Okay. Dear, is there anything wrong with it? I said okay. Abi, she be he brought you out and he gave you money. Dear. <coughs> no wala. Are you okay? I ah, no, I'm okay, no okay. okay. What's going on? <sighs> I'm 
sorry, dear. I, I, I was pained when I saw how the case Peter was giving you. I thought he was responsible for your pregnancy. You know, most especially when I saw you together at the supermarket. I was pained. It was not easy for me. That was what pain all this. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm so sorry. You suffered so much. I'm sorry, dear. It was intentional. I'm sorry. Where are my children? But I explain all this to you. I explain all this to you, dear. I can't believe that this is the reason why you are doing this to me. You know I can't hide anything from you. I'm sorry. I need to save our children. I know I've wronged you and my children. Oh, children, please, I need to see them. So, see. tell me, Tola Thompson, what gave you the reassurance that you are the father? My wife. Oh, I don't understand. My eyes are open to the reality now. Please, I just hope my children will forgive me. I've wronged them. I just hope they forgive their father. It's a wonder. I've always been thinking why you hate me and our children so much. Ah! I'm a gem, you know. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh. I'm sorry. So all this why you've been seeing your own children as bastards. Not any longer. I'm sorry. I'm going to see them. We are my children, my children. <laughs> the children has been asking about their dad. Grandma is busy doing something at home. That's why I brought them here. Ah, thank you so much. Thank you very much. Oh, are you fine? Are you okay? I'm sorry, oh. children. I'm sorry. Please forgive me, children. I love you. Please come here and to me. I'm sorry. I love wrong you. Please, I'm sorry. Please come here and to me. Let me be dead. Please forgive me. Forgive your father. Please, forgive your father. Forgive your father. Please, please come here. Please. I miss you guys. I miss you. I'm so sorry.